Christ out of his home in an Aleppo neighborhood, then controlled by rebels, to tend to his classic car collection. He used to own around 20 vintage cars, but several were destroyed in the battle for the city. When one of my cars is hit, it's as if I or one of my relatives has been hit. It's hard for me. It's as if they were my children. So I come down to check on them. In December 2016, the Syrian army regained control of Aleppo. Rebels and many civilians were evacuated. Mohammed had already fled two months earlier. He has since returned home, only to find his Buicks, Cadillacs and Hudsons in a sorry state. Just like his family home, a grand building from the 1930s. So Mohammed consoles himself with his pipe and his old gramophone. I've had a very happy past, but things have changed. Now life is hard, but we mustn't lose hope. His biggest hope, fixing each and every one of his cars. The 70-year-old has had offers to sell his cars, but he's turned everyone down and plans to distribute them to his children, two for each boy and one for each girl.